If you are testing the claim, the mean is equal to 200, and your significance level is 5%, what is the probability that you commit the type 1 error? Well, remember, we have this rule which says that for a one-tailed test, the probability of a type 1 error is at most alpha. For a two-tailed test, the probability of a type 1 error is equal to alpha. And all we have to do then in this scenario is to figure out whether we're dealing with a two-tailed test or a one-tailed test. So when I look at this guy here, this claim, I realize that they've given me HO. What does that mean then? Well, if HO is that the mean is equal to 200, then we know that HA is the complement of that. In other words, that the mean is not equal to 200. And with that knowledge in hand, what we're going to decide is very simple. Because HA has not equal to, we're dealing with a two-tailed test. And if it's a two-tailed test, the probability of a type 1 error is going to be equal to alpha, exactly, which in this case is 5%. And that's it. Again, we know it's 5% because it tells us significance level is 5% in this problem. It's a two-tailed test, so the probability of a type 1 error is exactly that alpha value. And that's it. We're done.